Good morning farmers. I hope you're all well rested because we got some work to do today. Well, we got work to do every day, don't we? So we're starting off, like I said, we're gonna finish harvesting this field. Won't take us but a few minutes to do so. Uh, I've gone ahead and hired a guy to plow the field just uh, on the other side of John's store. I've checked to make sure none of the maize fields or the barley fields are ready to be harvested and they are not. So once we get finished harvesting this field, uh, can I hire, uh, I'll probably try to see if I can hire someone to plow this field. Uh, we got to go up sell the grain. We got to park the harvester away because we will be done with all these fields for the harvester. Uh, once we sell the grain, we'll go down, drop off the trailer, get the cedar, and we got a seed. Uh, there's, a, I know there's a field I got a seed. Uh, I can't remember right now. I think it's that one up there. Uh, uh, the two hectare field. Got to put some pea into it. That sounds odd. Never mind. We got to put some <laughs> seeds into it. And then if we get, uh, we should have some time today to do some fertilizing as well. Actually, I can't remember. I gotta check now. Did I fertilize? No, I have not fertilized that one. I fertilized that one. And that one. And that one. So I gotta fertilize this field here. Uh, this one here, this one here, and this is the one I gotta uh, sow. Uh, the only job I checked that was worth looking at is maybe one of those fix the buildings if I get time as well. I don't think I'll even bother with it. We got enough moving around and work to do today as it is. How much, how much grain am I gonna get? Well, I could store this grain, but you know, I don't really see the purpose that we're not that far from the sell point. Let's see here. I'm just trying to figure out what order I want to do all this. Excuse me, do all this stuff in. Uh, head her off, head her up. And that quick job is done. So just under 4,000 grains, but you know, it's gonna be like it's gonna be pretty close to three grand, I think. All right, let's drive. Any rain in the forecast? Nope. What am I stuck on? Thank you. Oh, car, you came at the wrong time here. That car screwed me all up, man. And the scaffolding, really. <laughs> Devs, can you fix the scaffolding? Really, Van? Oh, wow. They stop when you don't want them to stop. Boy, the vans are the worst. Honey, call the insurance company. Oh, we squeezed in. Alright, we want to wash that. Uh, let's see, which way did... Now, in order for me to get the harvester to trigger this, I can only pull up one way. The first things first, we're going to drop the header. And I can only make it trigger on this side. And that's not even close enough.
There it is, right there. Yes, we'll wash the vehicle. Alright. Now we gotta get the heck out of here. Hitting the wrong buttons. Come on. Uh-oh. Uh Why won't you connect? It was there. Wow. All I did was wash the vehicle. All right, how if I get out of the vehicle? Is there a reason why this won't hook up? When did that raise up? Wow, okay. I must have hit the R button max and raised the header. That's why I wouldn't connect. Live and learn. Live and learn. Boy, they just made this yard just big enough for this header. Let's get out of here before a van comes along. Well, they're wasting about an hour and a half of our farming day. <laughs> just trying to watch the harvester make it look good for a while. And probably tomorrow, the corn or bar barley would be ready. And we'll park the harvester right where we always do. Uh, I don't feel like running over. Uh, there we go. It looks like he's almost done plowing that field. And now that I'm out of that field, which shouldn't matter really. I don't know if I can even... Uh, ready for... Yeah, okay. Oh, good. I can hire someone for that field, too. Yes, I've been hiring a lot of workers lately. But we like to progress a little... Well, I progress enough. <laughs> if I were... To, if I was to do all these fields by ourselves, I'd probably be just on this set of four of fields here. I would have started on those three or finish those four down there. Here comes that guy in the red van. Give him some room. Right, Calvin? I think this is Calvin up here. Yeah, that's Calvin. So let's go up here and deliver this and get her 3,000 uh, euros. Then, like I said, we'll drop off the trailer, pick up the cedar, uh, fill it up with some uh, pea seed. Then we'll head on over to that other field and we'll sow that and that'll take us the rest of the morning and into the afternoon. And then we can start grabbing uh, the fer uh, we'll grab the artificial fertilizer first and do that. And uh, if we have time, we'll grab the liquid slurry spreader and do that. Uh, we empty? We be empty. I'm kind of looking forward to the barley field just to see how much money we get out of that one field. And I think we, I finally guesstimated maybe 250 bales we'll get out of that field. After doing some calculation with the other fields that we did up here. 
So 250 bales is going to be a lot of uh, loading. And I don't expect uh, the devs put an auto loader in anytime soon. <laughs> Our little farmers didn't get a, a big workout uh, that day lifting up all those bales. These uh, fields down here have already hit their first growth stage. I wish I could buy some concrete at the uh, the hardware store and make myself a pad to park all my stuff up there with. I was ready to say, where's all my crops on my... My greenhouse, uh, they haven't rendered in yet or something. They're kind of, they're kind of glitching out right there. This should be empty, which it is. And I have not checked to see if I got enough seed for this, but I believe we should have. Uh, yeah, I got plenty. trying to figure out the fastest way to that field and I can't really tell at this moment because my brain's not thinking uh, there's that worker plowing away in that field and it looks like this worker is done here so let's see if I can hire someone to cultivate it That field there, I've been thinking about buying at some point. But I do like to get some uh, work from other farmers to do some social points. But we're in the time of the season where they're not really hiring for field work. Alright. Uh, this field here, cultivate for just under $400 or euros. Yes, please. This is the field that we need to seed today at nine o'clock. So this is probably going to take me until probably two o'clock in the afternoon. I would guess. And it may be time to change the paint jobs on my, at least my tractor. I like to keep the wife's tractor her color. This tractor is one I try to use most of the time, so I'll try. I think it's time to we change the color on it since we can't buy other brand tractors or anything at the moment. Round and round we go. I definitely want to get this field fertilized with both fertilizers because P does pay well. But I don't want to fertilize everything because I want to start stockpiling for the winter canola. When, uh, when mid-September comes, I'm hoping to have uh, both tanks full and 50,000 liters in storage so we can do most of what we can. But my guess is that plan is going to fail miserably for me. We may be buying some more fields when September comes as well. But we'll see how it goes and how we feel. See how we uh, manage to keep up with the 27-ish fields that we own.
But uh, let me get to seeding this wonderful field with the, these all these beautiful dips into it, and I shall bring you back when I'm pretty much done. So <laughs> I will see you in a minute. I should have enough seed to finish this field, which is always good news for me, anyways. And it is just barely into the afternoon, so not as long as I thought it would take. Which is also good news. Gives us more time to do more work on the farm today. I need to check on the other workers, see what fields are uh, ready to be proceeded to the next step. So we can progress. But as I was seeding this field, I was thinking about what fields need to be done on them and I I'm really starting to lose track of this stuff should be all these uh, three fields of peas should be all set other than fertilized and I've been thinking long and hard about the liquid slurry about how to do that just to make sure we got enough when September comes I know we're just in June here but you know you got you got to think ahead Alright, so we got this guy cultivating this field. This guy's done, so let's cultivate this field if I can hire someone. Alright. Uh, I gotta wait a couple seconds before I can hire someone else. It's kind of hard to see, but there's a field here. It's plowed, so now it needs to be cultivated for 160. Yes, please. We hired a worker for there. And what's the story here? That is plowed and not cultivated. Right? Yes. Uh, okay, I haven't waited long enough. I'm like, why can't I hire someone? Do I have four workers going already? Maybe that's my problem. Let's try it again. Oh, click the hire worker. There we go. Can I get something to cultivate that for 115? Mm -hmm. Yes, I can. Now, right now, I don't plan to hire anyone to sow the fields just yet, those four fields. Mm -hmm. We'll wait until tomorrow to see what kind of jobs pop up and see how those four fields are going. And we may sow most of them ourselves. We may hire a worker to do one or two fields. At least the field, I just want to get the fields prepped for sowing tomorrow. And if our fields are down, already down on the other end of the map, then uh, we'll hire all four workers to sow the fields and we'll go down there and work. Whoa, 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 where am I going? I need to empty this first. It's back in here. There we go. Okay, we're going to go up and grab the artificial fertilizer spreader. We'll come down and fill that. And the first field I want to do is the one just over this hill. And then we'll make our work our way around the farm a little bit. Until we get them all done. The field down by Oliver has been fertilized. I think I got that to almost 94%. So now hopefully I got enough in the tank to do this field here and that little one acre field there. We should have enough to do that. Then we'll have to go back down to the barn and refill to fertilize a field that we just did. Oops, I've already done that section. Oh, terribly wrong. I need to head uh, counterclockwise for a change. Screw up my steering rotation, though. Got, I'm so used to going clockwise all the time. 
Uh, come on. Why aren't you going up this hill? I'll lock in the second axle. Oh, yeah, now you're going to take off. I don't know what speed you normally would spread fertilizer at, but I think this might be just a little bit too fast. But it is just a game, so <laughs> we will go with it. <laughs> yeah, went up the hill that time, no problem. Round and round we go. Where we stop, nobody knows. I will say I can see some of the furrows still in the field from where the workers plowed and, and uh, cultivated, so I'm not sure if that's a glitch or are they actually there. Anyone else getting dizzy yet? I slow down for nothing. Turn it off. How much I got left? Still 30%. Oh, I didn't check to see the field. Oh, we're at 90%, which is good. Alright, let's head down to this field here. Get this small little one acre done. Turn on the uh, spreader. Uh, I hit the Z button. It should have turned on. Looks like it was on and I turned it off. That's interesting. Okay. Must have double tapped it somewhere. Yeah, I'm still questioning if I should... Uh, Fer uh, uh, liquid fertilize these fields or not. I think the next field that we're artificially fertilizing, the one we just seeded, I will, and the three hectare field, I will as well. Don't beat in our grass, dude. I may need that someday. Are we doing a fertilizer? We should have enough to finish this field. No problem. Turn it off. Make sure it's off. So I'm getting confused. Let's get this little corner here. And there. And there. All right, let's head back to the barn, refill, make sure I get out of this gate area without hitting anything, and I failed. Turn off that front axle. You're going to stop, aren't you? Oh, oh yeah, I forgot your van. You don't stop for anything. See how are our workers doing? We still got all four going. Never thought I would use the workers as much as I did when they first came up. So ah, I'm not going to use them that much. But I don't want to rely on them too much either. Because the one thing I do know though, I'm trying to keep myself time, that big field, we have to do everything ourselves in that field. 
and it will take us after we harvest it it will take me a full day no problem maybe then some to plow it another day to cultivate it another day to seed it that one feels like a one week's job in itself how are you guys all doing How are we doing on time here? Yeah, it's still only 4 o'clock in the afternoon, so not bad. And I was going to the wrong field. I'm going to a field I don't even own yet. They sure uh, double over themselves a little bit in some of the work areas, but... You know, they get it done. I was thinking about going over that hill and I thought better of it. Alright. Start spreading some good stuff here. Just need to finish off this middle part here. And we will be done. I might go up and get that little corner shapes there, the half crescent moons. Because we do got tons of fertilizer in here. Uh, what are we at for a percentage? 94% which is pretty darn good. Alright, let's bring this back. That looks like it might be William down there. I may hit him with a tractor. Does he get some revenge from yesterday? It's got to be William. It is. Hey, dude. Whoops, sorry. Didn't see you there. Boy, he's built like a brick. Looking down at his shins like, uh, dude, that hurt. I will say the grass is growing nicely. <laughs> and I could have swore when I first got the new uh, mower that it fit on the front of the tractor, but I must be wrong. Because I couldn't get it to fit on this tractor in the front. There is a PTO shaft on the front of this tractor. Yeah, I crossed the street without looking. We're going to empty this uh, fertilizer. We'll park it back up. Looks like the wife is doing a whole bunch of nothing in the yard. And empty the fertilizer, please. Thank you. Actually, I think after this, I'll take the tractor down to the other liquid slurry tanker and top that off. This should be, yes, yeah, that one's full. This won't quite fill it, I don't believe. Let's put some in there that we can. So if we do decide to come down and grab it, it'll be ready to go. Yeah, we didn't have much in the storage, so it's not going to fill a tank. Maybe get it to like 60%. Now 
And I just love how there's like a little bit of a stream running down from our liquid slurry tank. Storage area. But the other thing we're going to do, because we're down to 35% gas. We're going to wash it. We're going to fill up with gas. So first thing, refuel. Go back in. Wash vehicle. And then, I don't know, just do a little bit of weird stuff with it. There's an interesting color. Yeah, if you think that's weird, watch my uh, House Flipper episodes and watch the colors I paint rooms. It is different. I, I actually do like it now. It's kind of like a... It's not red. Can I get out of the... Thank you. I don't know, but we're going to roll with that color for a while. That's how I change colors of tractors. I just go in there and just zip them around a little bit. Sometimes I change my mind. But see, that's got a PTO in the front. Is the mower in here? I think the mower's in here. But I cannot get it to hook on the front. Is there a third linkage in the front? Maybe that's the problem. It looks like I got a third pin there. I don't have the bar on it, but I have the capability to do so. Doesn't matter, we can't mow anyways, right? Yeah, where did she go? Really? She went cooking. And that's why I can't run, because I'm hungry. There we go. How are the workers getting along? So that one is plowed and cultivated. These three guys are still going. I'm not even going to bother with that job because that's going to pay like 200 euros and 400 social points. I would like to start taking jobs if I can plow and cultivate other farmers' fields, but no one seems to uh, have any jobs for us for that. But this is the barley field. I kind of wish it would kind of tell you the, tell you the percentage it has grown. So you can kind of gauge how many more days you got left. It's like if this said, if you knew it grew, grew like maybe 5% per day, which is too much. Uh, it's probably more like 2.5% per day. Uh, so like if you came down here and you saw it said 90% grown, you know you got at least 5 more days before it's ready to harvest. But that's getting a little bit too picky, I guess, about the game. This crop down here. Oh, I got barley here as well? The heck was I thinking, man? If I put barley there, did I put barley in this one up here as well? I realized I could just check the map. No, I put wheat there. So... <laughs> Oh, uh, yeah, we're going to be doing a lot of bailing come in the future. If you build it, he will come. Just saying. Uh, there's a runaway bear on the road. Okay, yes, I do know that's a pig or a boar. They went around here to talk to? Hey, Tom, what's up? Tom. Tom, well, are you ready now? Hi there. Hmm. He sounds interested. You don't look so well. Are you all right? I'm perfectly fine, thank you. Thanks. See you around. Is that the only thing they ever say when I, I say they don't look good? Hi. Good evening, friend. Nice weather, ain't it? It sure is. Did you hear the latest news? I heard there's someone new around, but haven't seen him yet. I think she's referring to me, but I've been here for a while now. 
Is there something I can help you with? No, not at the moment. Thanks. See you around. I'm hoping they add more dialogue in the future. I'm still unable to hand out gifts, apparently. Okay. I couldn't remember if, we, uh, if I've already harvested these, harvested these fields yet and I cultivated them myself, but apparently I have. Yeah, I'm done having conversations today, honey. You're you're out to wait. Oh, opens in. I knew that. But that is where we're gonna call it an episode, guys. Hopefully you did enjoy it today. I feel like going for a swim. Looks like a nice day for a swim. Bring the cooler down, put it there, dive right in. But, I will see you guys in the next episode. Have a good one.